So you want to remove the sleep trigger from your map, but you can't just sell it. Keep watching and I'll show you how. Hello and welcome back to the channel. And today we're on a brown home on a new let's play. But this is going to be a let's play with difference. I'm going to show you how to do stuff on the map on farming simulator 19 today i'm going to remove the sleep trigger that's on the map that's in this house as you can see when you press r you can sleep in this house but i want to move the house unfortunately it is not in the garage so i can't just sell it it's not placeable so there is a way of doing it and i'm going to show you how to do it now so first off I need to save the game so I need to remember what the name the save game is and I'll just save it and I'll be back in a minute out on the desktop okay when you're out here in your desktop you go into your Explorer file Explorer it's down the bottom on Windows 10 you go into documents and then find my games when you go in here you'll see a folder called farming simulator 2019 so you need to go in here now the saved game that i saved earlier there was a save game number on it the slot that i saved it in it was number 11 for me but you might have a different number that number corresponds to the number on the folder here to confirm that you're in the right folder if you go into career save and when i told you to remember the saved game name mine was called class farm that's how you confirm that you're in the right folder now if you go into items and we go press f3 this will bring up a find box and we need to type in farm house press enter so this farmhouse here that's your trigger for your sleep and that line between item class name farmhouse placeable right to the very last arrow here is what you need to delete you also need to close the gap that's going to be created here as well so we just hit the delete twice then we go file save and that should take away the trigger so we'll go back into game and I'll show you the trigger gone Alright, we're back in here in the game, and as you can see when I walk into the house, the sleep trigger has disappeared. So that means I can place a sleep trigger anywhere on the map now. Also, if I go into the big map here, where the flashing arrow is, it used to be a house icon here. And now that I took the trigger away, the house icon disappears as well. So, let's go up to where I have my farm is quickly click on the tab so up here is where I want to put the sleep trigger now I have a few sleep triggers here in the placeables you find them under farmhouse that's your farmhouse from joints and from here on are mods so the usual one is these deck chairs because they're the cheapest and you can place them anywhere on the map but if you want somewhere to go in you can have this cabin as well or there are houses house mods that you can use as well and you just place them as normal so if I use the cabin here and find a place to place it out of the way preferably and make sure the door is opening the way I want it yeah and higher or lower to have the way I want to and place and that is my new oh right my new sleep trigger now you can only have one sleep trigger in any map so if I try to put the deck chairs down I should be told yeah only one item allowed per farm and that's how we get rid of the trigger for the sleep so 
I'm doing a class farm here on this let's play so I've all class if I go into me garage here I'll show you what I have uh, the class Argyon 410 and 870 to the Tycoon 580 and etc I also have the class front loader and that's it for the time being there are the class stuff that I'm going to put in so what we'll do today we'll get a contract we have some contracts here but let's get a fertilizing contract field 22 and uh, field 22 is here nice straight field up by the uh, spinnery okay so let's accept that contract and we'll go over to it accept contract between tractor and we'll go over uh which what does it want liquid slurry solid so either one will do so we'll take the uh solid one so i'll come back to you when i'm over at the shop so I'm over at the shop now, so I'll buy some fertilizer bags. Um, I think which is the cheapest? That's the barrels, isn't it? Can't get the barrels. Okay. I get this for now, and I get four thousand. Oopsie, too far. Okay, I need to buy another one. Get a thousand this time. I should fill it up. I think it's a five thousand, is it? Or six thousand? It's a six thousand. Here we go, 6,000. So we'll go to field 22 now, it's just up the road here. And I will uh, do the contract now. So I need to set up the GPS. I'll stop here for a minute. Uh, I'll see. Oh, do I have GPS on this? That's a good question. Don't think I put GPS on this. I'll just quickly put GPS on this and we'll come back to the field. Because uh, my trigger is around here, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. They used the new shop from the new FS19. I thought they might use the old shop that used to be on this map. Convert it across. Customize. GPS. Customize. Yes. Okay, so you on seat activate. So we press auto width to get the width, it's twenty-four width. Show lines set A now voice show lines. I could set A Okay, so set A. 
drive forward. Set B. Got F no, that. F twenty two. That's the GPS sorted. I'm gonna go and go in the wrong direction. The tree and be started. Now this let's play will be more answering questions that people might have about playing Farm Simulator later 19. So if you want to know how to set the GPS up or take the sleep away, the sleep trigger away which I just showed you or if you have any other questions leave them in the comments below and I will uh, go through them and answer them through a videos. Uh, if you want to put three question marks before the question so I stand out more to me than the um, ordinary comments that would be put down on the page. So we'll just get this done. I'll do a small time lapse on this and I'll be back to you in a couple of minutes. Okay, that finishes off the contract, so let me switch that off, and we'll collect this. Fantastic, so, like I say, thank you for watching the video. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up button, and if you're new here, I want to see more videos like this, or let's plays, uh, role plays, or even mod map reviews please consider subscribing and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.